Hello, I'm Lori Ann Zwicker, Deputy Fire Chief with Georgina Fire and Rescue Services. In 2019, the Ontario Fire Marshal mandated that every municipality in Ontario by July 2024 complete a community risk assessment. Then, use the community risk assessment to inform decisions about the provisions of fire protection services. Traditionally, the community risk assessment has been created as a paper document. Georgina Fire and Rescue Services has chosen to create a live data risk reduction portal. Data changes rapidly. This live portal enables us to have a proactive approach to ensuring we make more timely decisions and revisions to meet the community's needs. After eight months of data analyzing, we've created this base data portal. We will utilize it moving forward into 2023 to determine risks and risk areas and create target messaging to educate our residents and visitors to the risks. The town of Georgina is geographically divided into eight neighborhoods. Georgina Fire and Rescue Services felt that using the neighborhood polygons for determining risk rather than fire department response zones improved community engagement and buy-in. The neighborhood risk assessment assesses risk at both a town level and a more granular neighborhood level. The Community Risk Reduction Plan has been built on the nine pillars recommended by the Ontario Fire Marshal. By utilizing these nine pillars, we are able to build a community-wide risk plan that will prioritize our needs, evaluate the outcomes, and build sustainability. Community-wide response, an interactive overview of incident responses. This interactive tool provides us with the ability to follow our call data and determine trends through heat mapping. Medical, hazard, open air burn, rescues, fire, motor vehicle collision, or MVC, pre-fire condition. The eight neighborhoods identified are Keswick South, Keswick North, Roaches Point Willow Beach, Bellhaven Ravenshoe, Sutton Jackson's Point, Virginia Duclos Point, Port Bolster, Baldwin Egypt Eudora. The diversity of Georgina's landscape and its challenges for each community differ greatly. While Keswick South and Keswick North have a high population density, the urban communities of Belhaven Ravenshoe and Baldwin Egypt Eudora carries its own challenges in respect to farming. A brief description of the community is provided, highlighting water and highway access, retail, school and housing types, future expansion in residential and commercial, along with tourism information. The overall causes of fire in the community from 2019 to 2021 will be provided here. Community profile. Each community is provided with an infographic. Its population, population density, employment and education information. This is the data we use to create our target messaging. The top three languages are English, Cantonese and Mandarin. The top three causes of fire are electrical, cooking and smoking. Each community captain is provided an engagement project created from the risk assessment data and other survey related data. For Keswick South, the data from our recent open house provided us with home escape planning and emergency planning kits. Residents in Keswick South stated that further education on these two subjects would be beneficial for their families. We're very proud that this new innovative technology was built entirely in-house. An incredible team consisting of our talented GIS analytics, Georgina Fire in-house staff and corporate communications join their collective resources to create this risk reduction tool. Georgina Fire and Rescue Service is dedicated to ensuring the safety of our residents and visitors. As we move into 2023, we will continue to prioritize the community's needs, embrace opportunities and cultivate relationships building a more sustainable community overall and ensuring quality and preservation of life.